Well, we continue to celebrate Hispanic Heritage Month. Today, it's a spotlight on the talented Hispanic community in Philadelphia and the community center showcasing their work. The Esperanza Center in Hunting Park is at the center of it all. Our Marcus Espinosa joins us live to tell about his experience. Hey, Marcus. Hey, Chris, there's so much Latino art in the community of Philadelphia. Just behind me, the sculpture behind me was done by a native Philadelphian who's also Latino. Now we bring up Esperanza because a lot of folks know about that center, but there's a lot more to it than meets the eye. We have great cultures, we have great foods, we have great arts. Everything that America offers and then everything that our home countries offer, we can have right here. Reverend Luis Cortez is the founder and CEO of Esperanza, which lies in the heart of East Hunting Park. He's a well-known advocate for the Latinx community and has built a state-of-the-art facility to showcase the many talents of the Hispanic culture. Esperanza wants to create Hispanic-owned and operated institutions to serve our community. One of those institutions is called AMLA, an organization that seeks to promote the development, dissemination, and understanding of Latin music and culture throughout Philadelphia. Daniel De Jesus is the director of that school. He originally started through Esperanza as a student himself. Artist. Now he commissions works like this stunning depiction of the Virgin Mary. And I was looking at a lot of colonial art, learning about that history, and I, I made this image of La Dolorosa, but one where she's looking up and she has more hopeful eyes. Um, she's crying as you know, is traditionally depicted and um, she has this uh, you know, bronze heart, this heart that's glowing. De Jesus is a product of the supportive environment that is cultivated here at Esperanza. That support comes in many mediums here, but perhaps none more impressive than its state-of-the-art theater right in its building. It allows high school students to take part in exciting and creative opportunities. Yeah, that was better. Uh, not only for music, but for dance mm -hmm. and for theater. We actually, before, before the pandemic, we actually outfitted the space so that we could do live stream and broadcast. De Jesus says Esperanza is an incredible place to explore your passion. It's like access to resources and it's access to high quality education right here in the middle of North Philadelphia. Now, as a matter of fact, there's so much more to Esperanza that on October 15th, as a part of our 30-minute special for Hispanic Heritage Month, you're going to see a whole lot more, including the health impacts it's made on the communities and why Esperanza has helped that area become the most vaccinated Hispanic community in the country. Chris, live in Center City, Marcus Espinoza, Fox 29 News. I love that piece of art behind you, by the way, Marcus. Thank you, sir. It was a celebration.